The sign says, one, no bonnets. <laughs> Two, no house shoes, no house slippers, okay? Three, no pajama bottoms. Right here, right here, right now, right now. It's the right time, right time, right time. It's the right time, right now, right now, right now, right now, right now. Tell the whole pie down, pie down, pie down. What's good, Shadow Realm? It's your boy Reclaim Your Throne coming at you with another crazy video. But first, my goal is to get to 5,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So make sure you go ahead and like, comment, share, subscribe. And you already know, Reclaim Your Throne. So guys, we have to get into this. And I actually think this is a really good topic. Ah, the sisters are triggered again. And for all the wrong reasons, in my opinion, you know, we as a community need to start setting some type of standard for ourselves and this picture and the reaction to this picture shows you that we have gone too far astray from a standard okay of decorum out in public so this um facebook post says at my dentist's office and this was the first thing i noticed definitely jumped for joy now this is a black woman and she is saying that she jumped for joy when she saw this sign now what does this sign say well i will read it out to you the sign says one no bonnets <laughs> two no house shoes no house slippers okay three no pajama bottoms all right and then it also says we will be happy to reschedule your appointment per Dr. Sutton. So this is um, a, a, a doctor, a dentist rather. And <laughs> this man right here, he set a standard for his office. And a lot of black women on social media are triggered by this, but I don't see why. You should not be wearing, you know, bed clothing out in public, let alone to the dentist. See, the thing is, for one, it's kind of nasty that you're wearing the clothing that you sleep in out in public, okay? That's kind of nasty and dirty, especially if you're going to bed in that. But for two, it just doesn't make sense. What is wrong with taking the bonnet off, putting some type of, you know, appropriate head scarf on if you really need to cover, cover your head, maybe even wear a hijab, you know? Try, start... <laughs> doing something but the bonnet is is just not it and i remember monique was even though monique you know she has her own issues but she was telling the women to stop wearing bonnets at the airport and all that did was just anger the women and they revolted against that so um let's read some of the comments mm, the bonnet is definitely anti-black argue with your mammy I don't know why a healthcare provider is worried about what their patients look like rather than the health of their patient. And let's not act like bonnets are not functional. Sometimes you just can't do ish about your hair day as a black woman. Um, what do house shoes have to do with your comfortability and ability as a healthcare provider? It's just not professional. And this man is a professional. And it looks trashy when he got a whole bunch of bonnet wearing you know house slipper pajama chilling women in the lobby it, it, it just doesn't look good <clears throat> it's it's called a dress code it's called a standard um why does your clientele have to look a certain way for you to service a person in need of help as long as they are dressing in a way that everything is reasonably covered what is the and y'all know they don't cover up either like <laughs> stop it oh reasonably covered y'all don't y'all know they don't cover up either so um, what because they'll be having a tank top with low cut a low cut shirt that's showing 75% of their cleavage um, What is the issue even if it's inherently racist? It's rooted if it's if it isn't inherently racist but There we go on um, the race baiting. It's rooted in racism. The standard lacks understanding of others cultures 
and is based in whiteness as a frame of reference. As a non-black person, who are you to decide to, uh, to be in? As I mean, I don't see how bonnets, house shoes, or pajama bottoms have anything to do with your skin color. Anybody can wear these clothing. Uh, uh, as a matter of fact, um, I am with a woman who is not black and she wears a bonnet to bed. Keyword, to bed, to protect your hair from the cotton, okay? It's a satin bonnet. So uh, a lot of y'all just don't understand what's appropriate and what's not. Why y'all be wanting to tell other people how to run their business so bad? If you wanna roll out of bed and go to the dentist, go to Mint, cause Dr. Sutton ain't with it, yep. Um, if somebody got a bonnet on, that's their business. It shouldn't offend you. It's, it, it, it doesn't offend you. It's just unprofessional. So you see the black women are not, um, they're not with it. And they always talk about, oh, I got standards, I got standards. But the minute somebody sets a standard for their business, now you're mad. You already know what it is, man. It's your boy Reclaim Your Throne. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Send your relationship requests to your email down below with a screenshot of your cash app so I know you're paying on ties, man. Y'all need to be in your motherfucking need with the BS. You already know. Reclaim Your Throne. Want to become an elite level athlete? Well, look no further. The Reclaim Your Throne Elite D1 training course is all you need to take your performance from subpar to the creme de la creme of athletes all around the world. The purpose of this course is to give you a comprehensive weight training, speed, flexibility, recovery, and endurance program that is meant to prepare young athletes for collegiate and professional sports. This course is packed with over two hours of creative, action-packed lifts narrated and coached by yours truly to assure increased strength, speed, flexibility, recovery, and endurance. Hey, I get it. Training alone can be tough and can even make you feel misguided or somewhat unmotivated. But with this course, I walk you step by step through each and every lift to make sure you're using the proper form to prevent injuries and that you're hitting the correct muscle groups to render maximum results. So what are you waiting for? It's now or never. So go ahead and get the training course today so you too can reclaim your throne.